Hey guys, my name is Adam, your friendly Sasquatch, and today we're going to be talking about the Apple AirTags. Um, we love these AirTags, they work great for keychains, your bag, on your pets, or on other things that you may periodically misplace. However, while these AirTags are great, they are not rechargeable. They are battery powered, and uh, the battery will last for about a year. After a year, you're going to need to replace the battery, otherwise the AirTag will die and no longer be useful. So in this video, we're going to show you what type of battery you need, how to remove the battery and replace it, to get your AirTag back up and running once the battery has died after about a year. So first things first, you're going to need some of these CR2032 batteries. Uh, they're just these large button-sized batteries. Um, they're pretty common. You find them in bathroom scales, heart rate monitors, and these Apple AirTags, for instance. So um, they're pretty common. They're not very expensive. But before we can put this new battery into the Apple AirTag, we have to get the old battery out. To do that, we push firmly down on the stainless steel cover, twist in a counterclockwise motion, and then the stainless steel cover will come off with the button cell on the inside. So simply take the old battery out, then take the new battery, then take the top and put it face down into the Apple AirTag. You heard it just beep, meaning it's got electricity. And then we take the cover, line it up, and push firmly and turn clockwise to lock the AirTag. You're back in service. So pretty simple, right? In about 15 seconds, you can have your dead Apple AirTag back up and running. And don't forget to take your old button cells to a recycling center. Most hardware stores and office supply stores will accept old batteries and recycle them for you. Again, just to recap, the battery in the Apple AirTag will last for about one year. After one year, you'll want to get one of the CR2032 batteries, which are button cell batteries. You push down firmly, turn counterclockwise to remove the battery cover. And then to replace the battery cover, push down firmly, turn clockwise to put it back in place. I hope you found this instructional video helpful and cheers.